Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of some building big with germ. How are you guys doing today? Last episode we did some resource pack stuff. Uh, built that little house in there and I showed off this that I did off camera. Uh, oh wait. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Uh, but I've been doing quite a bit more stuff off camera. Uh, a lot. A lot of texture pack stuff. A lot of... Uh, well, a little bit of building. Here's just a little bit of it. You can see here. Got some archways in there. Uh, in the wall. Just to make the wall feel a little more fancy. Uh, but... Oh, I need to fix that right there. I need to add in some diorite bricks there. But, like I said, I've been doing quite a bit of work. So I'm going to show you that now. So last episode we built this, as you know. Uh, then I came in here and built this, and this is a new texture, obviously. Uh, this is, do I have any here? Um, probably over here. Let's see, right here. Framed bricks. Uh, in our resource pack, this is black, black glazed terracotta in the terracotta add-on. So I've removed the uh previously the black uh, glazed terracotta was like these uh metal looking blocks like a pipe a vertical pipe a horizontal pipe uh, a bronze block and then a rusty iron block uh and i made i added the rusty iron block as a variation to our regular iron block uh so i was able to get rid of that and then i realized i never really used any of the other blocks and I don't think I've really even seen anybody else use those in the past I was trying to think what could I do with the black glazed terracotta and I decided on this I decided to go for a uh, brick like a tutor this effect the tutor looking stuff with the brick and I think it looks Super cool. I love it. It's gonna look even better once we get connected textures For those blocks. It's gonna be so nice um, but But uh, that's not all I've done. You may have already noticed it right in front of us. We have oak log wall and This is the endstone brick wall as you can see from the little uh, little name tag at the bottom <clears throat> and I wanted some of these, I wanted some, oh, uh, some wood logs, or log walls, some log walls, and we didn't get them in 1.14, sadly, but we, we got a bunch of different walls that I'm never going to use, most likely. Uh, I don't have any here. I do need that, though, and that. Uh, so I just decided to change one to the oak log wall, and if we go, do I have logs around here? Yes, I do. You can see I've updated the recipe to match that. And I don't have regular logs, but I think it's craftable with the regular logs as well. Uh, the ones that have the tops showing. Uh, and then what else did I do? Well, here's <clears throat> here's something that people have been asking for for a little bit. I made the yellow carpet hay. Thought it was pretty cool. Um, oh, I've also fixed the names for the glazed terracotta add-on. That'll be out. That'll be out soon. I'll have a small update out for that soon. Um, what else have I done with the terracotta add-on? Well, I'll show. I'll go into a creative test world and show you in a minute. But I've also updated these blocks to look a little bit better. Uh, the trim didn't match our new spruce color anymore, so I fixed that to match that. And then I changed the interior, or the inner block. I changed the inner block from white uh, concrete to white, I think it's terracotta. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's this. Um, let's just put it here. You can see it's the same texture. So I think that's much better. I think it's a huge improvement over what we had before. Uh, it just blends in a lot better feels like it flows with the rest of the pack much better um, and then I've also changed one of the flower pots this is 
brown mushroom. When you put it in a flower pot, it changes to a little water bucket thing. And I think, I think I fixed the bottom too. Yeah, the bottom is uh, solid so you don't see through it. Uh, but I think that's super cool. I think it's a, a good addition. Um, I want to, you know what, let's take this. I'll get some more brown mushrooms later, but I want to put this in here, I think. Could be kind of cool, maybe. I don't know, maybe not. Oh, and I want to do, while I'm here and thinking about it, I want to grab some tripwire hooks, aha. Just one. Um, I think it was Sandman. He suggested I do this. Or maybe it was Pixel Brew. Okay, yeah, it was Pixel Brew. He recommended that I do this here. Um, and it definitely, definitely helps. I think I have a bucket of water around here somewhere. It's probably out here or in here. Uh, maybe not. We can worry about that later. And actually, I want to check. We're in the latest snapshot. No, you cannot put that on a wall yet. Um, oh man, that is a loud noise. Uh, we'll mess around with that in the creative world. But, hey, um, one more thing before we jump over there. They added, in today's snapshot, they added bamboo. No, they didn't. <laughs> they added scaffolding. And this is how you craft it, like this. Um, and I've added a recipe already to be able to craft it with sticks as well. Um, and actually, is that less? Did I screw up there? Yes, I did screw up, okay. Uh, we'll have to fix that later. But, if you don't know how this works, basically, put one down, and you can walk through it and whatever, but if you keep clicking in the middle here, you can just keep placing it up, and then you walk into it, hold space, and you climb it. Now it's much slower than the Bedrock Edition version of it. Um, in Bedrock Edition, you just go flying up it super fast. I think this is this is probably better though, uh, a little more realistic. Um, but can I do this? No, I cannot. Okay, interesting. Uh, there are some flaws with this. Let's chop this all down again. Place a couple, one, two, three, four. That should be good. Now let's climb up it. And you'll notice, if you hold shift to try to place on the side. Oh, what? Why am I taking damage? I guess because I'm on the side. Weird, I don't know. Uh, but if you hold shift, you'll just fall straight down. So you have to kind of very carefully get on the side and then you can hold shift uh, but you can only go out let's see one two three four eh, give me that and then one more and it falls so I don't know it's it almost makes it kind of pointless um, yeah it's it's weird let's craft up some more uh, not like that like that boom and then we're gonna plant some down so we can uh, get it growing by the way I went out to a jungle way out that way a couple episodes ago uh, well a couple days ago off camera and got some bamboo uh, but let's go one two three four and then have it here I think if we do this uh, one more then we shouldn't really, I mean, we'll have to, we'll still have to have supports, but eh, it'll be much, yeah, won't have to have as many pillars. I think the least they should do is at least extend the range that it goes because it's supposed to be replacing, like making dirt pillars and everything. And I feel like it's just hardly, hardly an improvement over that. If at all, because he, I mean, a lot of times I was using a lot of dirt pillars when I was making this bridge. And if I'm using that scaffolding, it's going to be way harder to stack up and get around with that than it would be to just make a dirt pillar with a ladder on it. 
I don't know. I mean, we're gonna have to make, we're gonna have to have way more of these than we would have to have of dirt. So I think there's some improvements they have to make to it, but I guess overall it's cool. It's, I mean, it feels like it's some that should have been in the game a long time ago. So I'm glad, I'm glad they added it. Um, but I guess now let's hover, head over to the creative test world and check some other stuff out. All right, we're back here in the creative test world and you can see some of my testing I've been doing with the uh, log wall uh, trees and it looks very, very nice. I'm very excited to get to use this. Um, let me know what you think. Let me know what you think if I should have these or not. Oh, okay, interesting. Um, and if there's any other ones that should maybe change, maybe, I'm thinking maybe red sandstone. All these other ones, I think I'm going to end up using though. Um, but let's see, what do I have to show? Uh, okay. So I've changed up, I already said I changed up this one. I've also changed up this one. The orientation for a long time was really weird on this one. Like you would place this block this direction and place this one this direction but this would be like that texture or something like that uh so they didn't match up for a long time and i've got them to match up also changed up the textures uh of course to match uh this texture a little bit better and the trim of our new woods uh so yeah i think it looks pretty good it's not a huge change at all but yeah it's all right um, I've also gotten rid of the yellow, the yellow glazed terracotta from the add-on, and we're just using the one from our main pack now. I think it looks pretty good. I like it. I just realized this kind of looks like, this shape right here almost looks like some kind of bird with really big wings. Like maybe this is its head. I don't know. <laughs> um, but then I also got rid of the pink. Uh, I think the pink was the different types of wool before. Um, this was just like a different, different, uh, pattern, but this was like a different type of wool before. And I got rid of that and made it the glazed terracotta from our pack. I think it looks good. Uh, this just updated with a new sandstone texture in the middle. Um, what else? This is a little bit different. I'm not sold on it yet. I'm kind of thinking I might change these to be like different blocks for each one again and then making it like different types of tiles i think that could be kind of cool um i'm thinking one would be like uh similar shapes to like our where is it this uh these kinds of shapes but of course a tile um i don't know i think it'd be kind of cool like a light cyan type of color might be cool uh, and then, of course, you already saw this. This is our black glazed terracotta now. Then, like I said, I also went through and renamed everything. So we got white tutor, wall blocks, brown tutor, painted wood, yellow terracotta tiles, uh, roof blocks, pink glazed terracotta. Uh, I need to change the name of this. I don't know what to call it. Um, so if you have any suggestions, let me know. It's this block. I'm not sure what to call it. Then roof blocks again, stone blocks, cyan, glazed terracotta, again, don't know what to call that. Red wallpaper, blue terracotta tiles, brown, mossy carved stone, brick blocks, and framed bricks. So yeah, I think those all work out pretty well, uh, all those names. Uh, again, if you have any suggestions for this one or this one, let me know. I don't know. Uh, I have no idea what I would call them. Um, but I've made a change to the activator rails. I made the activated version or the powered version. Um, the I, I made it a chain. So the unpowered is rope, powered is chain. Thought it looked pretty cool. And then over here, uh oh. Huh. Oh, hmm. Okay, they made some changes to the model, it looks like. Uh, I'm gonna have to fix that weird okay um but you can see here this is a big change uh oh why is that happening on top huh 
Okay, hopefully that's just a bug with the snapshot. Is it happening here too? No. Weird. It's like halfway, okay, whatever. Um, so I've changed the dead brain coral to a smoke texture. Uh, and I made this on stream a couple uh, a couple nights ago. Like I think it was Saturday. Oh, okay, it was last week pretty much. So this texture, whenever it dies, is now this. Uh, I think it looks pretty cool. I'm not 100% sure if I like it or not yet. Um, but for now, I'm okay with it. Uh, yeah, I'm okay with it for now. And then I made the dead horn coral the yellow one where is it this one uh, I made the dead version of that uh, like hanging fish and I might just go ahead and make it like one of the fans just so you can actually do it in survival okay I just picked the same one as that but I'm not sure yet uh, maybe and then you just saw I changed the red or the dead fire coral to like a hanging uh, bush type thing and I think this looks really cool. I'm very happy with how this turned out uh, Kind of inspired by a mod. I Don't remember what the mod was though um, but Yeah, pretty cool. I'm very happy with how it turned out uh, But yeah, I think that's pretty much all the texture stuff. I've done. I still need to update all these textures uh, and I also need to change this one now I want to change this to be like a wood, more of a wood looking block since I added the recipe for sticks. Um, but yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Oh, actually, no, it's not. One more thing. I re-added all the trap doors, all the different trap door variants, and not, the tra uh, not the wagon wheel, just like the plank textures. Added that back into the main pack. Um, so you can see no trapdoor add-on anymore uh, so that'll be back in the next version I, I just thought these were more a little bit more usable than uh, what we had previously so yeah I like that much better but yeah I think that's pretty much all I've done for the texture pack today um, so I guess let's head back over to the regular world and get to work on some other stuff all right we're back and I'm working on the wall a little bit because I didn't like how it looked before um yeah we gotta take this down as well uh but yeah I'm, I'm using this uh the new scaffolding and it's so far it's been somewhat useful um it is definitely i think it is better um yeah i think it is definitely better than what we had before uh you know what this is not right whoops well, we'll go with it for now. Um, but yeah, working on the wall a little bit because I wanna wanna get something a little nicer. Um, we're gonna have to redo this house, I think. Uh, gonna have to either move it or completely rebuild it from scratch. Um, I think I'm gonna rebuild it from scratch. Uh, I, I'm gonna keep a similar idea for it but I think I want to redo it because it doesn't really fit in with the rest of the style here anyways anymore uh, so gonna have to move it the main uh, the reason is because it's gonna be in the way of the wall the wall is gonna be coming right from this block over and then curving with with this side of it uh, so yeah definitely gonna have to do something about that I'm gonna have to move it or else the wall is just going to be cut through the middle of the house. Um, so yeah. But let's uh, let's hop down and take a look at this real quick. Oh wait, one more thing. Got to do one more thing. I do wish the climbing speed was the same as it was on Bedrock Edition. Uh, that feels much better. Let's go boom, 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 boom. Okay, here we go. Let's hop back down here and take a look at this. I think it's going to look pretty good. I uh, haven't updated the textures here yet for this uh, because I'm not 100% sure what I want to do with it. Let's see. Oh, yeah, that looks nice. It looks very nice. 
Yeah, I like that. I like that quite a bit. Uh, I am kind of thinking maybe sticking some walls in here. Some diorite walls. Let's see. Boom, 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 boom. Let's just craft a bunch. And then get me up here. Yeah, this is pretty nice. The scaffolding. Uh, what am I doing? There we go. And maybe, oh, it connects. Interesting. Ooh, that just gave me an idea. Maybe we stick some here though. Maybe, not sure about this. Uh, give me this back. Thank you very much. Okay, okay. Whoops. <laughs> uh, that hurt. <laughs> Uh, how did I okay wow uh, and of course I'm out of ender pearls uh, yeah I don't think I like those walls being there I wish we had walls of the smooth the the brick I think it would look much better if we had that uh, but we don't so let's just leave it as is for now uh huh and then I don't know let's see how it looks just like that leave that side on there I don't think it's gonna look very good nah nah let's get rid of this uh huh all right there we go yeah I'm okay with it I don't mind oh I missed a bunch give me that um but so what I'm gonna do uh, I'm going to I'm going to <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna build this wall out a little bit. You can see it gets smaller as we go, the different sections. Uh, and I want to, I wanna have a tower on the end here. Uh, a fairly short tower, but ouch. Oh man, I haven't seen one of those in a while. It's gonna be fairly short, but I want it to be uh, pretty wide. Get out of here. You get out of here too. If you don't know, we have a data pack in our world uh, that uh, spawns those killer bunnies and the the zombie horses. But I think I might be getting rid of it. I'm kind of over it. Um, but yeah, so I want to have a tower right about here. And I haven't 100% decided how we're going to do it yet or where we're going to do it. Uh, I need to figure out the shape for this wall, how this is going to flow. I'm kind of thinking I might have a big building over here. I'm not I'm not sure yet, um, but I'm pretty much going to have to redo this entire wall all the way around here. Uh, but yeah, so that's the idea. I want to, well, okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and fill in this wall here and get a base for this tower built up. And I'll be back with you guys in just a little bit. All right, we're back. And I got this wall pretty much done on this side. Uh, still need to tear this house down and do whatever on this side. And then I need to figure out this wall. This is going to be a weird spot. But like I said, I might put a building here. Uh, not 100% sure just yet. I most likely will put a building here, but I don't know yet. And then had to work out how this wall is going to meet up here. This wall was coming in here, uh, wrapping around and then going that way. So that was a weird thing I had to figure out, figure out where exactly this circle is going to sit. Uh, but I want to now, I have a reference image up. Uh, I want to try to work out a little, uh, the top of this tower a little bit. Uh, let's start out with this corner here I guess and give me boom 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 there we go uh, so let's go I think we're gonna use cobblestone for these spots and then brick for those spots uh, so we're going boom upside down stair upside down stair upside down stair brick brick you know what well we'll see I don't know if I want to do yeah let's just do it like this let's not do that we'll just randomize it let's not make it too uh <clears throat> too uh what proper i guess i don't know 
Okay, there we go. Got that done. A little trim around here. You can see kind of what I was doing. Maybe. You can kind of see it. It doesn't matter. <laughs> You'll see it in a minute. Um, but then... Oh, I should get some smooth quartz. Um, oh man. Okay, we'll do that later. Uh, yeah, we'll do that later. For now, I'll just fill it in with these blocks. Okay, I'm down here. Let's just go get some. <laughs> All right, got some smooth quartz and also got some more ender pearls. This is like a pretty nice though. Um, but yeah, went ahead and got the quartz. Let's hop up here uh, with the scaffolding, I guess. Boom, 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 boom. Just like so. Oh, this is gonna be so nice, this scaffolding. I didn't think I was gonna like it. Um, I mean, I even said, I don't, I didn't think it would be useful, but I think it is gonna be pretty nice. Uh, let, you know what, let's mix in some of this as well. Um, yeah, let's not, let's not worry about the windows for now. Okay, we'll go three blocks high here. And majority, majority of it should be the smooth quartz. Um, but, you know what? Let's do it this way. We'll fill it in. We're going to fill it all in with the diorite bricks. And then we'll come back through later and do the gradient. All right, there we go. Got that. Now let's go through. And the good thing about the smooth quartz is it also has stairs. Um, and we'll get some more of that as we break it out. But we'll just go through and break some of these out and replace it with uh, stairs for the windows. Boom, boom. I need to re-add, or I need to add the variation for these stairs uh, just so it's a little bit more randomized like the uh, like the block, the actual block is. All right, and then one last thing. We gotta go back up here to the top and come around. Let's get this on the bar, whoops. Uh-huh, there we go. And just go around the top with a little trim of the polished diorite slabs, just like so. And there we go. Okay, let's hop down and take a look at this. Imagine it's not gonna look uh, like anything special, but I wanna see just how this is gonna look. Oh yeah, this is gonna look pretty good, I think. Once we get the roof on there, of course. Um, I'm also kind of considering making a glass that looks like uh, arrow slits. Maybe, I'm not positive on that. Not 100% decided on that yet but I think it could be pretty cool. Okay, yeah, I like this. I think I might, I might move those blocks, the stairs down a block, but I'm not sure. Um, let's climb up here. Eh, nope. There we go. And one more. There we go. Anything fall down here? No, okay. Um, but now, what I need to do, I need to come back through, or I need to go in and make the roof. So that's gonna be quite the task. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and get that done, and I'll come back with you guys and we'll end the episode off there. All right, we're back, and we're pretty much done with this thing, I think. Ooh, yeah, that looks pretty good. Yeah, I like that. I like that quite a bit. Uh, I'm thinking now, I'm probably gonna update these tops to match something similar to that. The curve is a little bit weird. Like, what is that spot right there? That, something, what is that? That wall, I guess? It's kind of throwing me off the curve. Yeah, that one right there too. But from an angle like this, more of a straight on angle, it looks better it helps let's see yeah like this angle right here that looks good oh that looks oh i like that a lot <clears throat> like i said though there there's some work that could be done to it like i think that stair right there this one right here 
I think I might replace that with a wall. Maybe, I'm not sure. Uh, something else I did, I replaced, or I changed the texture of the prismarine wall. Instead of being the rough version, which it was before, I changed it to be the brick, like our roof tile. And I think it's much better, much more usable. Um, let's get rid of this crap. Get this out of here. Just wanted to farm up some of it to, uh, to craft up some bamboo, but, or to craft up some scaffolding, but we can, uh, we can make it with sticks with our data pack. Yeah, I think that looks pretty good. I'm fairly happy with how that turned out. Um, maybe, hmm, maybe we should add a flag coming off of that. Do we have any wool up here? All right, let's take a look and see how that looks. Went ahead and put a flag up there. Uh, I should have done, oh man, dang it, I didn't wanna, didn't wanna get some of these blocks stuck up here. Well, I'll put this here for now, but let's step back and take a look at this. I think, I think it'll look all right. I'm not sure, I'm not great at flags. Yeah, that looks fine. It looks a bit bulky, but I think I might add a fence on top of that. And then maybe, maybe have it come, well, I think it's good. I think I like that. Yeah, I think I like it. Um, but, you know, these scaffolding, they look really cool. I'm kind of thinking it could be cool to have a section of the wall look like it's like under repair. Uh, like maybe there's a, there was a hole blown in it or something like that. Maybe we'll do it on this side, not this side. But if we have a bunch of this up there with some platforms, stuff like that, and with if we make it the spruce color, we can add in some spruce slabs and trap doors and stuff. We can make some pretty cool looking stuff. Yeah, it could be pretty cool. I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong. <laughs> uh, but I think that's going to do it for this episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to leave a like. Um, let me know what you think of all the snapshot stuff. And there was some other stuff too, like you can edit signs now. I don't really care about that um you can uh well the villager the illager beast and the pillagers spawn now uh didn't really care to go over that so you can go back do this feature they should have had a long long time ago but it's there now so that's cool um but how do i get out of here here we go uh but yeah oh let me know what you think of this stuff these new blocks. Uh, I love this house. I love how it looks. Um, and yeah, I will see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye. Yay!